Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, also known as Green Eye Phoenix Goddess here on YouTube. I am a Pisces, but I love all signs. I love everybody. I deal with all signs, but I think you'll find guys as a Pisces, I try to do lots of different things here on my channel. So please stay tuned to all of the amazing things coming. I do member perk memberships. Um, I have my website. I do personal readings. I do all kinds of amazing stuff. I also have subscription boxes that you can sign up for. So I have lots of fun different things that I do on my channel. So I really hope that you'll look around and that you'll join the family and that you'll subscribe. So don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And to all my returning subscribers, you guys know how much I love and appreciate you so much. Guys, as you know, these readings are always very general, so anything that is pertaining to your particular energy, please, anything that is pertaining to my channel will always be linked down below. How to book personal readings with me, how to donate to my channel, how to follow me on Instagram and Facebook, any type of sales or deals or anything, everything will always be linked down below in regards to my channel. So, with all that being said, guys, let's get into the video. Excuse me, Libra. Sorry. <coughs> the nice weather's coming. And like my allergies just want to get tickled now. And not just that, but like I have my incense going and all that stuff. This sometimes it's just, ah, you know, you take a breather. You're like, oh my God, I can't breathe. Anyway, Libra, welcome to your love reading for April 2021. So Libra, so this month what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull a couple of tarot now, I recently bought this deck and it came along with a Manifesting Your Soulmate Oracle, which I'm going to also use in today's reading. Plus, we're going to get some things that maybe you guys need to work on in your heart space. We'll get, you know, some love oracle and then we'll end with a mindful message. All right. So let's get started, Libra. What do we got going on for my Libras in regards to love for April 2021? What do we got going on? my Libras okay mm -hmm. all righty okay <laughs> all right Libra okay so Libra all right so let's okay so you guys got the lovers then you guys got the four of wands and you guys also got the empress all right so Libras take the energy how you know you see fit but you definitely so there's somebody here that you got this is the funny thing i have a couple things going on here so there's some of you who can't make a choice between two people now some of you you just can't make the choice right but then others of you are actually involved with somebody else but you actually love another person as well and that's where the issue's coming in because you can't seem to make a decision over heart, over head. And I just said this to Taurus as well, and they're telling me to tell you guys the same thing because you guys are kind of going through something similar, right? Now, with the um, with the four wands here, you guys have a, a reunion coming that you want so badly, like with this person, right? There's like literally a reunion that you want with a particular person, and you guys have been thinking about this person very heavily, and you guys really see this person as somebody who is very, it's almost like you guys see this person, take it how it resonates. It could be that you're looking at this person as your goddess or if, you know, vice versa, you're a god type of thing. You know, like this is like your person, like you look to them and you're just like, wow, like they can't do any wrong. Like that's how you feel about this particular person. Okay. So yeah, Libra, I mean, honestly, like I said, there, you know, that's kind of, that, I mean, that's just, this is what it is. <laughs> this is, this is what it is. This is what you guys got going on here. You have to make a choice, you know? Um, you have to make a choice in order to unblock, you know, you have to make a choice in order to unblock this. Um, yeah, this is going to weigh heavily on you still. This is going to still weigh heavily on you, Libra, because this person is going to still stay in your heart space unless you get rid of this person. You know, it's it's a different thing if you decide that you want to stay in the situation that you're in and then you want to let go of this person. Well, then you have to let them go in your heart space mentally, physically, emotionally. You have to let them go. But you're having a hard time making this decision. This is what you, this is, if it's resonating for whatever Libra out there, okay? That's kind of what's happening in your heart space is that there's just a person that you guys can't seem to let go. Whether you're with this person or not, or you want to be with this person, vice, or however you plant the story, right? 
there is somebody in your heart space that you're having a hard time letting go of Libra. Okay? Take it as it resonates. It could, like I said, if it's not your message, it's not your message. It doesn't resonate, it doesn't resonate. But for the particular Libra that I'm reading for, because these are all general, right? There's definitely somebody in your heart space that you're having a hard time letting go of. Okay? Now, you do want a celebration with this person. But like I said, in order for you to um, block whatever's going on and maybe help you make the decision, the, the choice needs to be made. There is a choice that needs to be made. Okay? Let's see. What do we have as far as manifesting so many oracles for Libra? What do we have? You guys got you are you are spiritually you are spiritually connected to those you love. Now it's funny, Libra, because a lot of you don't. It's I've said this in another video at another point as well for you, Libras, but. A lot of you are spiritual, but then it's funny, but then you have a hard time believing. Does that make sense? Like you're spiritual, but then you have a hard time kind of like believing that you can completely entrust, if that makes sense. All right. Let's see. What do we have for Libras that maybe they need to work on in their heart space for all my Libras watching now and all my Libras that we're watching later? So you guys got regrets. I regret not following my heart. Look, what was I just saying? What was I just, Libra, what was I just saying? Then you guys got affirmations. I need to use more positive words. What was I just saying, Libra, right? It says regrets. I regret not following my heart. I was just saying that you guys have, there's a person that's still in your heart space that you feel very, you know, very like regret you're like you feel like a lot of regret about it all right so regrets right not following your heart then you guys got the affirmation speaking more positivity into yourself not even just to, into like your life but your love life your love like everything emotional then you guys got vanity i'm self-absorbed now take that it doesn't it's not going to resonate with every libra right but for those of you who feel like maybe you have to you know look better than others in order to prove that you made it or whatever there that's kind of like what they're talking about like don't let that you know take over you okay libra so those are just a few things like i said it may not resonate with every single libra but those are a few things um that you guys could be working on maybe in your heart space to help maybe give you clarity in regards to this decision that you have to make right what else what else do we have for libra incoming abundance yep once you make that decision once you make that decision you can finally feel like you can start building a foundation with someone. Structure, right? That's what you want. You're looking for balance, yep. And apologies, making amends with somebody. There's this person. I keep, this person keeps popping up here for you, Libra. And then you guys, you know, it's funny because a lot of you want, they like you normally do do yourself up, but because you're working so hard, you guys are not really paying attention to yourselves as much. And so it's just a gentle reminder that, yeah, you can take one day and, doll yourself up you know maybe put on your favorite slacks if you're a dude or whatever you know what i mean like something that makes you feel confident something that makes you feel sexy you know but there is definitely this person here libra that keeps popping up here for you that it's it's like it's almost like you're having a really hard time expressing yourself to this person because you don't you've already been vulnerable with this person but it's like you still feel like you lost this person, you know, for whatever, however way she performed that that resonates for some of you or whatever. But there's some of you, like I said, who are feeling very much regretful about the way that something went down with someone. And, you know, you're, you're thinking very heavily about it. Like you want to, you know, and I feel like some of you may have already kind of like made amends with the person, but like you still feel the need to like say more because you feel like if you say more, maybe the person will understand and they'll come back. Right. Now, for some of you, if you allow yourselves to be completely vulnerable and like open up to this person and maybe make the decision to choose this person, this person might give you a chance. But for others of you, depending on how far like the cycle went in this particular connection, um, you, you definitely lost this person. I don't, this person's definitely not, unless you come with a really, really significant offer this person's not going to want to hear it. And again, you know, you can place yourself where the energy goes, right, Libra? So this could be your person, you know, doing this to you and vice versa, you know, depending on somebody's cross-watching. But, you know, I'm, I'm going by what the energy is and what's what I'm picking up from the energy. So place yourself where you need to go. But, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm getting that 
This is very much your energy, Libra, towards your person, all right? So let's take a peek. All right, so let's see what mindful message we have for you guys. You guys are pretty simple this month, I gotta say. Like, there's not really much that they have to say. They just want you guys to make a choice. There's a decision, a decision that needs to be made, for sure. So let's take a peek. What mindful message do we have for my Libras to end their reading? Let's see. Let's see. What mindful message do we have for Libra? This deck has a lot of energy. I think I said it in another video. Yeah, this one wanted so. Yep. Okay. So you guys got breathe. It's easy for me to return to the present moment simply by breathing. If I am feeling anxious or worried, I close my eyes and breathe in deeply as I picture myself filling up with white light. Then exhale and envision stress and tension leaving my body. In this moment, I am free to gently stretch and open my eyes feeling refreshed. All right, Libras. All right, Libra, so that ends your love reading for April 2021. I hope you guys found this helpful. I hope it resonated. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I love and appreciate you guys so much. And I will see you guys next month. Bye, guys.